Today we are going to demonstrate how to use the BTNX Rapid Response COVID-19 Antigen Test. In British Columbia, when your age category is eligible, you are entitled to one box of five tests every 28 days. You will need your personal health number when picking up your box of tests and the pharmacy will need to process the kit for you, so please allow for a bit of time at the pharmacy to do this. Here is a list of the items contained in each kit. It is important to remember that rapid tests are very time sensitive. If you are presenting with symptoms and receive a negative test, you may want to consider retesting in a day or two, as data has shown that these tests may not be as sensitive, especially in the early days of symptoms. The test kits are stable at 2 to 30 degrees Celsius until the expiration date on the box as seen here. To complete an at-home rapid antigen test, first be sure that you have washed your hands and washed the surface of the counter area that you are using. Start by placing the extraction tube into the test tube rack. Twist the cap off of the buffer liquid and insert 10 drops into the test tube or, if you prefer, you may empty the entire quantity of buffer liquid into the test tube. Remove the swab from its packaging. Have the person tilt their head back and insert the swab about half an inch inside the nostril. Rotate the nasal swab within the nose for 5 seconds using a circular motion. Compress the nostril with the fingers to trap the swab tip and rotate the tip for a minimum of 5 seconds. Remove and repeat for the other nostril with the same swab. After completing the swab of both nostrils, insert the swab into the extraction tube. Swirl the swab, mixing well, and squeeze the swab 10 to 15 times by compressing the walls of the tube against the swab. With the swab still inside the tube, leave the extraction tube upright in the tube stand. Let the swab stand in the solution for two minutes. After two minutes, remove the swab while pressing the swab head firmly against the inner wall of the tube to release as much liquid as possible. Dispose of the used swab safely so as not to contaminate any other person or surface. Attach the nozzle to the sample extraction tube. Invert the tube and add three drops of the extracted solution into the sample well of the test device by gently squeezing the tube. Start the timer for 15 minutes and wait for colored lines to appear. Read the results at the 15 minute mark. The test is positive if two colored bands appear on the membrane. One band appears in the control region, C, and another band appears in the test region, T. The test is negative if only one colored band appears in the control region, C. The test is deemed to be invalid if the control band fails to appear. An invalid test result means that the test must be discarded and repeated. Please note that the color intensity may vary in the test region depending on the concentration of analytes present in the specimen. Therefore, any shade of color in the test region should be considered positive. The manufacturer also states that it is important to remember that a negative test result does not preclude SARS-CoV-2 infection. If you do have symptoms but your test results are negative, you should take precautions so as not to spread any illness and consider retesting if you are still symptomatic in the coming days.